Hey everybody, Rare Diamond is True Loyal back again with another video. Today we're reacting to another Vid Chronicles video. Wife had her husband killed for money. Let's get into it, guys. Morning, handsome. Good morning, beautiful. Sure smells good in here. Mm -hmm. What's your favorite? Oh, baby, you shouldn't have. No, oh, but I wanted in. you to feel special. Oh, <laughs> oh, you do make me feel special. I feel special every day having such a beautiful caring. Don't make me blush. <laughs> oh, hey, uh, can you make this to go for me? I need to take it to the office. I'm running a little late. Thanks, honey. Mm -hmm. I'll see you later. Good day. Dang, it looks like you never know who somebody is. You see how her whole demeanor changed as he walked away and she texting somebody right now. He just left the house. He's driving a black Mercedes. License plate is Y213. Okay, I'll take it from here. Hey, make sure he's dead. I got you. Wow. Worry. Do you have the other half of that payment already? Yeah. I'll meet you at the same spot. Okay. Tonight at nine. Okay. Look at that. Mary! Oh my god. <laughs> yeah? What, why are you crying? What's, what's wrong? You haven't heard? I heard what? They should have called you. They called everybody. You're his wife. They should have called you first. I, I forgot my phone upstairs in the bedroom. Why? Why are you crying? Hey, what's going on? It's Jonathan. What about Jonathan? What, what's what's wrong with him? Something really bad happened this morning. What what happened? What happened to Jonathan? Someone pulled up next to him when he was on his way to. She gotta act like she hurt. She gotta act like she hurt. Where they shot him? <laughs> Bruh, she knows she knows she ain't sad, bruh. <laughs> you know you ain't sad. No lying in it. Wait, but then her friend hugged her and her friend looked like she stopped crying, like she know that she part of it or something. Let's rewind that. Hold on. <laughs> Look, see, you see how she was, she was crying at first and then she hugged her to comfort her, you know, but then rolled her eyes. I feel like she know that she had something to do with it or something. You know, normally I don't ask my clients why they want somebody killed. But why did you have husband killed? What if they didn't really kill him and like set her up to take her to jail or some shit? Let's just say he deserved to die. Take the money. No, he didn't. He seemed like a nice guy. Shoot! Yeah, Wait, under, he's no, an undercover no, no, no. cop. What's going on? Hold on. So they all was a part of it. That's why she was going to the house crying. 
to act like she heard about it or whatever. And then she was part of the setup. And then, of course, her husband, you know, too. I don't want to talk to her. You do not need to talk to her, Johnny. No, I have to. Why? Huh? What did I do? Why would you want to kill me? Two kids? Five years of marriage? Hey, y'all got kids together and you gonna kill the father of your kids? And been married five years? I work two jobs so you don't have to work. You never really know someone. Man. I gave you everything. Your dream house, your dream car. I treated you like a queen. And you wanna have me killed? What did I do? He never loved you. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. No, you're no. not. I'm sorry you got caught. I want to know the motive. Because how you going to be sorry? Oh, I, I, I'm sorry. I, I'm sorry that I tried to kill you. Like, girl, no. Like, you real cold-hearted if you try to kill somebody that you love and you've been with and created a family with. you cold-hearted. Why would you want to kill me? It was for money. What money? She knew that if you were dead, that she would get your life insurance money. That's why she had you choose a bigger policy. She was playing the long game, and now she wants a big paycheck. <laughs> no, that wow. can't be true. Mary, tell me that's not true. Is that true? That is true. Tell me that's not true. I'm sorry. you know how she overheard you dang she heard her talking to somebody Okay, I, I can do that. Look, I want him dead this Thursday. I won't be able to pay you until after it's done. I'm doing this for the insurance policy and it's worth six million dollars. So, your money is guaranteed. I'm sorry, I can't pay that. I'm sorry. No, hey, hold on, hold on. Your wife is trying to kill you. I mean, she's trying to hire someone to kill you. Don't be ridiculous. What are you talking about? I just heard her having a conversation on the phone. Rena, are you joking? Do not. No, no, I'm dead serious. I just heard her. You're telling me Mary wants to kill me? Are you sure you heard her right? Yes, but she didn't have enough money to pay the hitman, but she's gonna find somebody else. Why would she want to kill me? It doesn't make any sense. Just... Don't say anything. I have a plan. We knew that if we confronted you, you would have lied. And so we got of course Carlson to pretend to be your hitman and see if you would really go through with it and try and kill my brother. Disloyal woman. You want to kill me? Dang, that's his sister? Your husband? Who takes care of you and provides for you? What, over some insurance money? Words can't even explain how I feel right now. But God has a plan for people like you. Your own actions will be your demise. <laughs> and your sin shall be your torture. Please get her out of my face. I can't stand that when people want to uh, make a lot of money, they go to thinking evil, hurting somebody and killing somebody instead of thinking smart and being like, what type of business can I start up? You know what I'm saying? Like, you have, like, where do they minds be when they think of this stuff? Like, it's so much, many ways to make money legally and stop, and stop trying to kill people and hurt people for money.
Jonathan, I'm sorry. These cases are strange, but I've seen it before. It's gonna be hard. It's gonna be really hard to tell the kids. Yeah, yeah, it is. It is. I can't even believe it. This is just un freaking believable. I mean, my wife. He didn't know who he married. The moral of the story is there's a thin line between love and hate. The human brain creates a new thought every 60 seconds. Be mindful of the people around you. It's the ones closest to you that hurt you. Yeah. We live in a world that is driven by money and greed. Everyone wants to be the richest. Everyone wants more and no one is satisfied. Don't let your greed get the best of you. Thank you guys for watching. Stay tuned. I'll be back with more videos and I'm out.